hello and welcome to what amounts to football heaven. It doesn't get a whole lot better than this. The conditions are utopian. The sky is blue and the players are with us for a football match so widely and keenly anticipated. Truly, this is pristine and the uh, level of expectation and excitement is reflected in the smiling faces of the crowd. They know it means so much and they also experience between them a great sense of privilege at uh, being able to attend this most special of games. Certainly this is a very, very impressive venue, quite a sight to behold. Things have got underway here pretty promptly. So Jim, tell me this, who are you looking for in particular here? Yeah, Isco. He's the one with the magic feet, Peter. He's the kind of player who can change a game with a single touch, unlocking a defence or, or creating space to get a shot away. I'm assuming that he's been tasked with being the creator-in-chief here, and you can see him picking out runners and, and setting up people in that final third. I think the opposition defence agree too. He's going to be the source of so many of their headaches. Hakimi. Sancho. He's making good use of his strength there, just refuses to be out-muscled. Well, I don't think it was the wisest option, Peter, once he got into that position. It's not as if he didn't have people nearby. The Sakio gets good distance on it. Rabio. Quadrado crosses. Juventus have been put... Rabio! Oh, that's a terrific save from the keeper. Well, you can't ask for much more than that. A difficult moment he simply had to deal with. And here's Christian. Has a goal! And again, the keeper stands strong. Oh, that's a stunning save. I mean, his reflexes were incredible then. That's as good a save as you'll see. And we've seen lots of the ball. Trying to go for it a bit. A bit of creativity and adventure. That's a throw. And here's Isco. Hernandez has it out wide and in space. There are a few waiting for it. And that's one way of trying to make things happen. There's a few who could follow that example. Chip through. Donnarumma deals with it effortlessly. Goes long. Defending of the desperate variety. Bruno Fernandes. And the shot! Oh, nearly. But nearly is nothing. Well, that's confidence for you. Distance doesn't even bother him. Romagnoli drives it forward. Fernandes finds himself back in the starting side for the first time in a while. Gets a good foot in there. Rabio with a definite fell there. Forward tracking back like that, always appreciated by the crowd. I think it's great to see that kind of application and desire from a forward who wants to help out his defence. I, I think, you know, any good team, really, the striker should be the first line of that defence, and, and he's delivering. Hernandez concedes a free kick for that. Oh, 
And it's Alexandro. And helps available out wide. Cross deflected behind for a corner. Cristiano Ronaldo. Ronaldo opts to play it back. He's gone for it! Cleared without complication. Bruno Fernandes. Now can he fit it? Real chance! Goal! Juventus! And that is about as cool as they come. He picked his spot expertly. Now that's what I call finishing, right in the corner. He knew instinctively who was where and didn't need to waste any time weighing things up. That's a cracking goal. Juventus take the lead. And that ought to be the trigger for a really exciting and entertaining game from here on. There's a long ball. Romagnoli is there and he can get that clear. Going through, forward it goes. Lucas Paqueta. He's there to receive it. Shoots! And out to safety. He's made sure that that won't get through. And he's going long. Sancho provides an outlet. Gets away from his opponents. Has a hit! And the referee brings the first half to a close. And there we are, off they go for half-time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half. But there has only been that one goal. It is very, very tight. Well, you obviously have to give credit to the front men for the half-time lead, but I think the midfield can really pat themselves on the back too. They work tirelessly for me. Juventus come off having scored the only goal of the game so far. It's been tight, it's been exciting. There is certainly plenty for us to chew on during the break. Just back from your break, we've missed very little of the resumption of the second half. Well, it's been tight, Peter, but I'm expecting things to, to open up now and we get some free-flowing football. Usakio. Hakimi. Brandt. Quadrado plays it forward. Rabio plays it long. And that has been cleared. Oh, that is asking for trouble. Yeah, it looks like a, a change of approach, and it may just freshen things up. Sakio gets it away. Final checks on the touchline. A change about to occur. And to Bola! Thinks he's got rid of that. Hakimi. Built as the single goal between the sides. Hoists it forward. So who's he? And they've been towering header! Harmlessly behind. Oh, no, that was a chance. What a chance.
Out to the left it goes. Back into the middle. Tries to get it forward quickly. Good challenge, he just stood firm. And it's played forward. It's on a plate. Bruno Fernandes! Donnarumma trying to get there. Has gone out. Hernandez. Bruno Fernandez. Timely intervention. Pedrado was not to be moved. Dybala pings it out wide. Great leap! Really well taken goal. Offside. Well, obviously, some sections of the crowd would disagree, but that was the right decision, albeit a late one. A moment's uncertainty there, but it is the right call. Oh, decisive action by the goalkeeper, he knew he had to get that done. He's played him through, now he's gone for it! Oh, he did the hard part right, but not the finish. Sancho certainly did his part with a lovely pass, and unfortunately, the loveliness ceased there. <laughs> Isco plays it short, turns and goes back. Oh, that is lovely footwork. Brandt. Brandt hits that long. Milan are definitely not going down without a scrap. Their attitude just can't be faulted. Sane goes up and over. And the defence can get it clear. There's a real appetite from them to finally put this game to bed, but will they? Yeah, that does look a foul. Referee's given a free kick. And this is the perfect opportunity to create a cushion between the sides. This certainly looks appetizing. Well, with it. Hammers! Crossbar comes to the rescue. He's had a shot. And it's James Rodriguez. It's obvious that they prefer a greater cushion to sit on, but will they? Gets his foot in there. Well, that looks a foul. Yep, referee's given it. Over to the left. Finds himself eased off the ball. Brent. So time is near. Hits one! Oh, he's managed to get it all wrong. Oh, it was such a clever pass that plummets the defence, and it could well be revisited, this. And it's Suso. Has he picked him out? Big chance! That's a fine save! Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra sharp. Isco with the short one. A good challenge. Stood up well against his man. Look, with time running out, they have to get the ball in the penalty box, and if it means a long punt, then so be it. They've got to give themselves a chance. Well, the ball's come loose, and the chase is on. Hetic. Referee looks at his watch and blows his whistle.
terrific contest. It really might have tipped either way. The margins were tiny, just a goal in it, but that was enough. So, Jim, how do you reflect on what we've seen? Well, a result which owed much to grind and graft, Peter. Not the prettiest of wins, but a very professional performance, I would say. And a clean sheet, of course, is, is always very welcome. So that's it for today. Thank you, Jim. And good afternoon, all.